everyone, it's Ellie with Positive Med and today we're coming to you from the gorgeous Miami and we're going to be talking to you about birth order and does it affect your intelligence. However, this topic is a very controversial topic. Um, scientists have been going back and forth about it for years. Since the late 1800s and the finding of psychology, scientists have been going back and forth on this matter. That does a person's place in the family really affect their IQ or their intelligence? Keeping this in mind, the first 21 out of 23 astronauts were first born children. In 2010, researchers conducted a study on 200 birth orders. They found that the firstborn child has a higher academic level, they're more influenced by authority, and they are more driven. Middle children have a fear of belonging, but they're more social. The youngest children are, mo are the most rebellious ones, they are more likely to become alcoholic. They're more empathetic and agreeable. The only children have some behavioral problems and are, they tend to be selfish. However, keep this in mind that no two families are the same. The only thing that scientists do agree on is that the firstborn child has the advantage and the last born child has the freedom of their parents. It only makes sense because when you're the first born you have a hundred percent of the attention and the love of your parents while when you're the last born the parents tend to be more lenient towards you and give you more freedom. So what do you think? Are you a first, middle, or last child? Do you agree with these facts? 